No signal. Namco! Alright, so, uh, the Xeno Saga. And the subtitle beneath it is, uh, it basically means, well, no, it, it directly translates to, uh, Will to Power, which is a book. It's a reference. Uh, I guess I'll just push new game. No, no intro movie or anything. Okay. Oh, do I need to push start? Yes. Oh, this is gorgeous. <laughs> 20XX. I haven't seen that before. Around there is hard, so be careful when you dig. Yes, sir. Doctor! Doctor Masuda! What is it? Did you find something? Yeah. We followed the corridor from the lakeside. It matches the location described in the that research must be paper. It. Good. Show us where it is. Now interrupting each other. It's different from the others. I knew it! It's over there. Hmm. No. No, 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 no. PS2? Oh, you've got to be. Uh, oh, 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 no, it's working. It's working. Uh, um, let's just mute that for now because, because that's not a great sound. Wow. We, uh, uh, is it frozen? It might be completely frozen. Cool. BRB. From the lakeside. I was muted. Cool. In the that must be it. Good. Show us where it is. If it's if it freezes in the same place, I'm gonna throw something. Basically, all I said. It's different from the others. I knew it. It's over there. We're good now? This oh.
That's pretty. Uh, excuse me? 4,000 years later? Jeez! Cosmos. I know that name. Startup experiment. Open up an interconnection. Roger. Opening interconnection. Connecting with dummy protocol. A line yeah. protocol is secured. Opening cage partition. 60 seconds to release. Beginning countdown. 57, 56, 55, 54, 53, 52, 51. Disappear. Three, two, one. Partition open. Proceeding with Cosmos body formation. Body formation complete. Commencing pen field mapping. Cephalon construction. Mapping percentage at 76, 77, 78. Encephalon construction complete. There's noise appearing in the temporal lobe. What's the problem? It's on the left side of the temporal lobe. I'm showing slight stimulation of the synapses in section 818. It's within permissible bounds, though. Do you want to abort? No. Let's keep going. Just stick to the menu. I'll try for a direct approach. Back me up. Roger. Launching Nataraja connection system. Password accepted. Commencing Nataraja boot up sequence. What? 
Oh. with the visual field connection. Oh good, that was in the game. Ah, I see a small break in the MT field, route K12. It looks like the bi-directional link in the V4 field is lagged too. Hold on a minute. I'll fix it now. How is it now, Chief? Okay. Looks good. Let's keep going. Roger. Proceeding with Cosmos host separation. Good morning, Cosmos. How do you feel? Good morning, Xi'an. All systems are normal. Well, how about introducing yourself? I am an anti-gnosis humanoid fighting system. Serial number 00000000001. Development That's name a lot of zeros. CX, abbreviated name, Cosmos. As I am currently configured for simulated battle, my output is limited to 22% of its normal capacity. Hey, Matt. My estimated weapon specifications are... All right, that's good enough. Thanks. You are welcome. All I have for you today are the usual startup tests. Sorry to wake you up just for that. You'll have to go back to sleep once everything's checked out. I see. Do you feel sad or anything? A predetermined set of emotions has been hard-coded into my emotion module to better facilitate interactions with humans. In order to better facilitate a relationship with you, Chief Engineer Shion Uzuki of the Cosmos Project, Vector Industries' first R&D division, I will emit an expression such as sadness only when that response is deemed necessary. However, the emotion module of my program has determined that this is not necessary at this time. <laughs> I guess you're right. I, of all people, should know that. Your understanding is appreciated. But you know, Cosmos, I've got mixed feelings about all this. Of course, I'm happy that you're awake, but the fact that you'll go back to sleep makes me a bit sad. On the other hand, the next time you wake up, it may be a time of much bloodshed. So deep down inside, I hope that day never comes. Understand? The algorithms I have been programmed with do not support the comprehension of illogical human thought. Well, I hope you'll be able to understand someday. I will do my best. All right, Cosmos, shall we get started? Alan, let's pick up from process 277 where we last left off. Roger. Placing target drones in the encephalon. The drones are set to random movement and enemy ambush. How about a test run before the mission, Chief? Hmm. Sure, let's do that. Did you get that, Cosmos? Affirmative. Virtual Tutorial During quest, you'll trigger a battle when you come into contact with an enemy. Here, you'll need to talk to Cosmos, from, uh, select from the menu, then approach the soldier to start battle. So I need to talk to you. Target input complete. Normal attack. Battle program has been set. Entering battle mode. Please approach the target. Okay. Okay, here we go. Normal attack. 
leftmost character in the group turn window uh, at the bottom right corner of the stream or the screen will get to go first. Uh, okay. The character next to the leftmost character will th follow thereafter. Okay. Order is reshuffled once the character icons disappear from the GTW. Uh, characters that are not dis uh, displayed in the GTW cannot make a move until the character order is rearranged. Makes sense. Press left and right on directional button. Uh, just like target, square, and triangle to perform normal attack. Okay. There are th three types of enemies. B, M, and G. During target selection, there are marked dead. G, M. BMG. Makes sense. Two AP is used for each normal attack. Since you are given four AP each turn, you can perform up to two normal attacks. So I can just select them and then trying. Spin kick. Cool. As a basic rule, square is a physical type and triangle is an ether type. Okay. Ether type are displayed in red. Gotcha. So, physical. Sword. Neat. That's a lot of information. <laughs> Just on that screen alone. Oh yeah, Chief. Almost forgot to mention about the body flashing phenomenon. After a battle, you'll flash for a few seconds. During this time, you won't trigger a new battle even if you come into contact with an enemy. Oh, okay, that's good to know. Thank you. Anything else you need to do? Changing targets. Deck attacks. But basically all of this is tutorial stuff, which is probably important to know. Uh, 6 HP are required to perform a tech attack. If you are only, uh, if you only attack once and use X to end the turn, Two AP are carried over to the next turn. Okay. Guarding is another, uh, another effective method. Because you are given four AP each turn, they are added to the two carried over for a total of six AP. Okay, so... Medica. Assuming that's healing. And X is back. Okay. Firecracker. End. Oh, with attack attack. You can only carry uh, attack once and use the X to end the turn. Two AP are carried over to the next turn. So, I need to use this. Lots of X's and O's. Now you can perform a tech attack with 6 AP. Oh. So, square, square, circle, or triangle, triangle, circle. Uh. I think I got it. Maybe? Maybe. Yep. 
defeat this enemy with a tech attack. So knuckle and then end, and then I carry over those two to the next turn. Tech attacks for Cosmos. Ooh. R blade, R cannon, and uh, oh, it's just blade cannon or G shot or M shot. Warning: the sub weapon attacks performed by pressing circle can only be used a set uh, set amount of turn. Set amount of times per battle. Makes sense. If they're powerful, they it makes sense they'd want to limit them. Uh, check to see if it can be used by looking at the panel to the right of the button display panel. Contents are ammo, EP, consumed, required AP. The attack can only be... Okay. So if I want to use G-Shot, I can only use it a certain amount of times. Oh, is it supposed to be, like, Gatling shot? The enemies have been exterminated. Okay. I'm learning. Cool. Submenu. Submenu. When you press X without doing anything else, submenu will appear. Uh, use ethers that have been set. EP is required to, in order to use ether. Okay. Uh, item. 3 AP consumed. When uh, Use items when in your possession. Be used as a W item. It's a W item. Place the cursor or over an item and press triangle to select. Item will have an effect on the entire... Oh! Two items will be used, however, so W item will only work if it, you have at least two of the same item. Okay. Change positions during battle. Ooh, okay. AGWS is that. Enters the assigned uh, blah 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 characters who are not assigned to that cannot use command. Okay. <laughs> Reduce the amount of dan oh, okay, so it's just guard attack. Escape commands do not exist in this game. You must either use an escape pack or Xion's goodbye. Okay. No running away. Gotcha. So I need to use an ether attack. Okay, but that's only healing. So I hope I hope my audio is delayed. I just realized that. Jeez. Yeah, it's delayed. Okay. <laughs> that would have been bad. Boost gauge rises uh, whenever a normal or tech attack successfully hits. When this gauge fills all the way, boost counter can uh, goes up. Oh. Because it's difficult to raise the counter in this battle, we'll set... Oh. Okay. In order to use boost, character must have at least one boost count. It must not be displayed... Okay. Okay. Boost. Okay. So she can boost. Pushing 
focus physical attack. Got it. Event shot. A small slot uh, to the left of the GTW changes in the following uh, in the following order with each turn. So blank up. Okay. This is the oh, that's the event slot. Thank you. Effects of the slot icons. Okay, so that's critical hit up. Okay. And this appears during the enemy's turn. Their chance of critical hits increase. Oh. Becomes easier to raise the boost gauge. Earns more special points. What are special points? That was what I was going to ask. Thank you, game. Uh, points can be earned by defeating enemies. By utilizing special points, players can increase and evolve players' abilities beyond their normal level-ups. Cool. Uh, ether points. Use the points to evolve either uh, ether spells or transfer spells to other characters. Ooh, that could be cool. Skill points draw out skills from accessories. Oh. Tech points change the character's basic parameters. Meaning what? Okay, do I need to do anything special with these two? Yes, no. Power King. And Cosmos' attack is up, so I should probably use a uh, physical attack. Dang. Firecrack. Cherry Bomb. Oh, that didn't do it. Okay. Spin kick. All right, I like I I actually really like all this stuff. Switch to real combat. Battle program has been set. Yes, 